We're with Margate manager Steve Watt after his side's 3-2 victory at home to two at the Mitcham. Uh, Steve, it was a wet, miserable afternoon, but three points eventually. Uh, happy this evening? Yeah, well, I said to the guys before the game, today's a must-win game. Uh, with the Staines game getting called off, uh, let the boys know that if we win today, we've got a point within fourth. Um, that's regardless of what any other results happen, and obviously Hendon Drew, which, which was a good result for us also. But um, no, I asked the boys to win today, not all costs, obviously they've got off to the worst possible start, but the character of the boys to come back in the game and get and get comfortable in front was fantastic. And then look, it's another such sloppy goal concede, and we make it a little bit more difficult for ourselves than what we should. But this boys knows it knows how to win games of football, and that's, we've got to give the boys massive credit again. I think that was our 40th game of the season, I believe, which is incredible. We're not even the end of January, and um, there's some tired boys out there. But again, they've gone out there, they've given their all, and most importantly, they've got three points for football. Club. You talk about character, Steve, and Lenny Pidgey returned to the first team today, and um, would be disappointed to have let that goal in in the first minute. But he uh, he done well, didn't he, after that? And uh, you, you're happy to have him back in the squad. Massively, look. He's, he probably he came in and said he should have done better with both goals. Um, Pitch is an honest keeper, an honest lad. Um, I think he's been fantastic for football club this season. And um, I said to him for a little half time, I said, you haven't put a foot wrong in every game you've played so far. Don't worry about that. Go and, just go and do what you do. And I just think having his presence back in there helped today. Um, I thought he did. Obviously, he can do better with goals. I don't need to tell him that. He knows that. Um, and he's held his hands up. But, I thought he, his rest of his game, he managed the game well. The way he manages clocks and, and, and manages games and, and situations is fantastic for back phone. His communication is excellent. So it's great to have him back. Um, obviously, we'll see how he reacts from today. Hopefully, it's all positive. And hopefully, from now on in, we've got Lenny back um, week in, week out. And at the other end of the field, another two goals for Jordan Chidozzi, uh, 23 now from 30 appearances this season. Um, he's been electric, hasn't he? Yeah, look, that's why I bought the football club. Um, he's a great striker, he's a goal scorer, and um, no, he's finished his day with brilliant. You know, and I've got to say, you've got a keen, great effort and, and work rate to close the centre half down. And obviously, a fantastic ball, and it is a great finish from Jordan for the second goal. And obviously, penalties this season, he's been deadly from the spot as well. So, um, but no, look, he's been a great, great player to have, and great to work with. And as I said, he's getting, he's reaping the benefits. He's, he's finding back in that regular. Uh, that's one thing I said to him when he came in and started the season and he wasn't quite fit. He missed a few games and that because of his obviously he was injured in the summer. And I said, look, you'll take your time. Don't don't worry, the goals will always come. And I said, they're, they're coming now. And I said, it's, it's, it's a great asset to us. And just finally, Steve, back here again, Tuesday night for the fifth uh, game in a row. Um, and another tough game. Farrock, they beat Leverhead today 2-0, but um, expecting just another difficult evening, I presume. Yeah, look, Stimmer's done a great job with Thurrock and he said he, he, he knows how to put effective sides together. And it's, uh, I remember he was playing fast in the season and saying that these guys will be, there'll be no pushover this season. And it's in, in, he's, proven, uh, he's proven me right. And um, they've had a fantastic result today. And we'll come down here Tuesday full of confidence and it'll be, a, it'll be a tough game. We've got to approach it right. We've got to um, make it a little bit more difficult than we made it today at times. But as I always say, I think when opposite managers and other dressing rooms are looking at our side, they're worrying a lot about how to stop certain things. So I always say to the boys, if we turn up, if we play our game and execute our game plan correctly, we'll win most games. And uh, as I said today, we didn't start off right, but we got going, got back in front and was able to see it out from the end. That's brilliant. Uh, well done today, Steve. No problem.